Teleport into Time Master. mode with the plug I tell you they really did a great job um, making a couple adjustments to the time master now I have the 2018 no 2017 all right I had a 2015 I had one um, the first year it came out it was fine it didn't cut as good they put a little you know they made some changes with the baffle system but Remember, this one only has the 8.75 foot-pound, 190 cc motor. I think now it's like a 228 and 10.5 foot-pounds or something like that. But thing's a beast, man. Absolute beast. Um, I use it a lot for leaves, um, but you know, this time of year cutting these small properties um, you know it, it gets the job done I love it one of the one of the you know reliability with these mowers guys obviously the trans it's not you know it's not a commercial grade mower now when I say that it's not that you're gonna have issues with the engine um, you know with the cutting with the deck you know you're going to have issues if you're going to use this commercially with the transmission over time. Um, I don't have too much of an issue with the trans. I haven't replaced anything yet, but, you know, it's one of those things. Sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. And, you know, you're probably like, what are you talking about? It either works or it doesn't. When I'm going up hills, that's when it really just doesn't work well. But when I'm on flat surfaces, um, you know, it still works pretty, pretty darn good. And it is quick, but um, you know these things are good. And you know I've been saying, if you've been watching my videos with the Time Master, again I featured this on the channel a month after this was released, after this came out, and um, you know it's proven itself. All right, and I think it's just a little bit better option than than the the uh, Toro. Remember, well, not the, this is the Toro. I'm talking about the uh, the Turf Master. Or the X Mark, you know, their commercial, I forget what the heck they call it. But um, it's, it's, it's half the price, okay? Um, it's half the price. You're gonna get a, power, a more powerful motor. Now, you're not gonna get a better motor, but you're gonna get a more powerful motor. And the biggest difference is this folds up and it's absolutely huge. How this folds up and down uh, the actual handle here. Why they didn't do this. You know, especially, you know, if guys are using them commercially, you got to load these in the trailer. Putting this in the trailer, I mean, it's absolutely a breeze. Uh, I actually have my truck today. I don't even have my trailer out today. But if I didn't have this, you know, if this handle didn't fold up, you know, half of this would be hanging off the side of my truck. Right? So, you know, I just fold it straight up and it's perfect. Absolutely perfect. So you can see cutting huge grass and it's in mulch mode. You know, normally if this was a really nice lawn, I'd probably mulch it. Um, I mean, not mulch it, excuse me, sorry. I would bag it, but this is like all crab grass and everything. But as you can see, not too bad. All right, let me get cutting here. We'll catch it. Yeah, guys, and I'm going to tell you, I'm loving this Fuel Works gas can with the fast flow technology. Five gallons in 60 seconds. Made in the USA, too. Uh, great gas can.
I'm actually rocking with the 2.5 here. Um, I got the five as well. But what makes these things great is they're stackable. But I mean, that's just you know one of the features. Best feature, man. This thing will fill your mower up quick, super quick. Actually, I did a video last year, but I'm gonna do another one where you can actually is it just snip this. Just get a pair of you know cutting pliers, and this thing will go down. I kind of have the safety on this one, only because I usually use the two two and a half gallon for my blowers and weed whackers. But um, I had to bring this mower today. It's so wet that um, I've been using the uh, Time Master. Like I said, only yeah, I did a pretty good job. Just gotta finish up blow and a weed whack this sucker. But it's been so wet, as you can tell from the grass, because this is usually all weeds, but it is just so green because it's just everyday rain. Every day rain. So um, a lot of my properties are wet. Didn't want to bring the heavy zero turn out. So I've been using the, the Time Master. That's what makes the Time Master great. You know, when you need it, it's there. Again, I love it with mulching leaves up in some of these small properties. Bagging them, throwing them in the trash can or any type of can. And um, it's just a great mower. I actually got to do a fuel filter change on this sucker. Um, yeah, November 2015. So I think I got this in 2016. Or maybe it was, I don't know. I think I got it in 2017. I'm telling you. But this is model year 2015. All right. I guess this came out. Because this does have the baffle system in it. Um, I actually got this from Home Depot for like 700 bucks, like 675 bucks brand new towards the end of the year, like, you know, November, December, something like that. But, um, you know, it's a nifty little mower to, to have around. Um, if you want something bigger than a 21 inch, you know, push mower, you got 30 inches here, get your jobs done. And, it, you know, it's really just like a regular push mower. But that's about it. Um, you're going to see me hopefully at the depot because I got to get something, but I got to make sure I have my mask and my gloves. And I'll tell you, I don't know. Well, it matters where you guys are located, but I can tell you, man, all you hear on the radio. All right. So like if you're in your car, I don't know. I mean, I know a lot of people, you know, there's regulations, you know, stay at home, whatever they call it. But all you hear on the radio is corona be safe you're doing great. we're gonna beat this like i mean all day long and i listen to talk radio sports talk radio so not only are you know the sports talk people talking about you know the coronavirus but every single commercial is about covid19 who's open hey we're not closed come on in and you know, all these service, you know, don't be selfish, stay home. We can beat this, but we got to be smart. It's just like, I think we get the picture, but it's crazy. But hopefully everybody is safe and doing well. Um, but we'll catch you guys. Flip. Also, I, I used up all my 9 amp hour batteries and uh, I didn't get a chance to charge them. So I had to grab this 3. And I'll tell you, it works pretty darn good with the string trimmer. Uh, obviously, it keeps it really nice and light. But obviously, this has the 21700 cells in it. Um, and you do feel that extra power, even with a, you know, a little 3 amp hour. And I'll tell you, the runtime, not that bad. I don't know maybe 20 25 minutes i don't know close to that but um you know i like the eights and if you notice now actually i was gonna make a totally separate video on this now but if you have noticed with the new ope kits from milwaukee they are now did exactly what i said as soon as that eight amp hour um high output battery came out so instead of the nine high demand if you've noticed, a lot of these newer OPE kits are coming with the 8 amp hour high output. So, like I said, don't be surprised if they kind of phase that 9 amp hour battery out at some point. Obviously, it just doesn't make sense. Um, you know, you got an 8 with 21700 cells. 
it's a little bit more compact though it actually weighs more than the nine but you got you know 18 650s you know i don't know i just don't think that you kind of need an eight and a nine and especially with the nine being 18 650s but we'll see but uh, again don't be surprised if uh they do what i said because actually they're doing it uh, like i said a lot of the new um, ope kits whether it's you know the the string trimmer the blower it comes with the eight amp hour high output instead of the nine high demand so that's it peace peace oh yeah what's what's great too is check this out i got the dewalt boron all right and the dewalt moron now, i don't know what the heck the new one's called i'm freaking i'm mowing the freaking lawn and i'm like something's not something's not right here something and it's two different shoes one's the boron and one and i tell you they feel exactly the same you couldn't you know they're identical except they got different names this little the tongue's a little different here but um yeah look at this well you take the freaking look at this the boron the moron <laughs>